What's up, everybody? Welcome to Podcast Now Plus. I'm Alex, and in this video, I want to talk about the Persona extravaganza that we had uh, today because of the Xbox Bethesda showcase. Now, I want to talk about a couple different things because we obviously got you know Persona Three, Four Golden, and, and, and Five Royal on on coming to Xbox, right? And, and Five is going to come out in October, this October, and then the other two, based off of the end graphic that Microsoft showed, they're 2023 games, right? They're within the first six months. Of 2023 now we also don't know if they're going to come to playstation right because those two games aren't on playstation so we'll see if they're skipping playstation and just going to xbox but one thing i also want to talk about is persona 6 this is a media and maybe nobody really cares about this at the moment because we're getting all this persona news but what does that mean and this is not like a, a fanboy like a console war thing it's a genuine question so what happens with persona 6 right I, I would assume that PlayStation kind of had prided itself, considering it took this long, right, to get Persona on other things, Persona 5. Like, it took them this long, and so you have to think Sony kind of values that partnership that they've had with Atlas, where they have some sort of exclusivity for Persona. So, you, I guess, again, before today, before maybe the last couple of weeks, because, of course, there were the rumors, you know, of Persona kind of leaving, what you know do they do they keep that going into persona 6 or i think the safest option probably to say right now is persona 6 would probably be uh, uh maybe comes out on everything maybe persona doesn't you know because they did i believe atlas has talked about how they want persona on more than just one thing now that could have been not well it could have been a dig in general right to playstation but it also could have been a hint of hey we're talking about past games we want past games let's just put them out we know they're gonna sell if we put them on different consoles right so let's get them out there could have been that could have been a mix could have been that and talking about future games so like a persona 6 maybe there's no reason to do it just on playstation we'll do playstation xbox pc switch by the way switch really gets just punched in the face with this entire ordeal which is a pretty uh, pretty tragic move i would say overall but but i do wonder i do now we're years away you know for persona 6 i you know even even when it releases in japan and that's probably what's going to happen right it, it'll release in japan and then maybe come to the u.s or in other markets probably six eight twelve months after that so you know we have a while like at least an another year and a half to two and a half years but when it does happen what does it you know release on maybe one hint could be and, I, and correct me if i'm wrong i did see this online i think this could just be outside of japan i'm pretty sure like the xbox japan or even atlas japan a, a bunch of those none of them said persona is making the jump there so it may only be in the west that that it's that it's making that jump so maybe that says something maybe that says something for persona 6 that persona 6 immediately starts only on playstation then we'll move to xbox later maybe it in japan it's only on playstation everywhere else it's on everything maybe you know the there actually are more options than you would imagine you know for a, a scenario like this so it is definitely a good day for persona uh you know it deserves to be seen by more people that i, I absolutely agree with and being on game pass i mean there's no excuse you know, Persona 5 uh, Royal obviously is so good. Persona 4 Golden is, is absolutely amazing. So these are some great, great games. So I really do hope more people play it. And then, yeah, the, the first thing I immediately thought, sadly, and it's a problem with me, I think, to the future more than the present. But the first thing I thought of was, all right, well, what does this mean, you know, for the future? What does this mean for, like, a Persona 6? So we'll see. We'll see what happens. Let me know what you think. Do you think it stays on PlayStation? Do you think it's uh, kind of just third party in general now? Let me know. Make sure... You guys are subscribed to the channel, bell icon turned on so you know when all these videos go up, and I hope to see you all on tomorrow's video.